clear onto the terrain's new style. GMC's ditched the third cues, and smoothed so many boxes out into a sleek and comely shape. The roof line glimmers in metallic trim, while a blacked out portion of the rear roof pillar appears to make it float. It's a cue headed rapidly toward cliché, but it looks great, here and now. Inside, the terrain's cabin can wear warm tone leather and aluminum trim, and it hangs together despite looking like three individual unrelated zones. For performance, GMC offers a choice between three engines. We thought we'd be more smitten with the Turbozil 4, but its slight on tow capacity, produces noticeable vibration, and accelerates moderately. High EPA fuel economy notwithstanding, most drivers will be better off with a new 1.5-liter turbo 4 and 9-speed automatic in base and mid-range terrains. It's good for 170 horsepower, and quick to respond to the throttle, though GMC's console-mounted transmission switches make any driver involvement a remote possibility. The best choice is a 252 horsepower 2.0-liter turbo 4 with vivid acceleration that doesn't diminish even when all-wheel drive is on board. It's a rudimentary part-time system that requires a spin of a knob to spring into action, 